Good morning, everyone. My name is Jason from Country Bell. Country Bell is a news platform that focuses on bringing you positive news that will put a smile on your face and lift your spirits. Right now, we are doing our weekly roundup where we go over the most in uh, interesting and exciting news we covered this week. We won't be able to go into all the details on the news, so if you want the full story, make sure you check out our website and our social media pages. But without further ado, let's get into it. Nigeria is coming out with a new electronic currency called the E-Naira that will be landing um, on the 1st of October. CBN has come out to say that this currency is backed by the Central Bank of Nigeria. It will carry all the same, you know, all the same values, risks, and liabilities as our normal natural um, paper Naira. So there will be no business that will be allowed to not accept this as a form of payment because of that. So, you know... Um, what do you think um, this development means? How do you think this is going to pan out? Please let us know in the descriptions below. There's an amazing story that's been going viral recently. A Nigerian woman uh, who wanted to get out of the country, she made her way through Libya to Italy. It was a very harrowing journey. She spent two weeks in prison in Libya, only to get to Italy and to find out that the only work that was left for her was prostitution. Upon hearing that, she turned back came back to Nigeria. Having trouble finding a job, she decided to work as a vulcanizer, a female vulcanizer. People have been praising her for staying true to her morals, keeping you know, her virtues, despite all the temptations and how hard life can be sometimes. Kudos to her. That's an amazing story. To find out more, make sure you check out the link we'll leave in our description below. Goulder's Ultimate Search is coming back after five years. After dominating the TV screens up until 2016, it left on a five-year hiatus and now it is set to land on October the 16th. We can expect more thrills, more entertaining challenges, more, you know, um, dangerous, you know, settings and events. And I definitely look forward to seeing it. I don't know about you, but keep your eyes peeled. World Peace Day took place on the 21st of this month. It was an amazing time to reflect on how, you know, as a global community, we need to always chase peace. We shouldn't let differences get between us. But we can also apply that in our personal lives as well. Peace is always the best way. We're always better together. This is just another reminder. I'm taking this chance to remind us all of that. And please, you know, have peace with your fellow man. There has been an amazing viral moment that happened um, two days ago between Rihanna and our very own Thames. Um, they met each other at the Fenty event, at um, Rihanna's Fenty event in America. Rihanna was excited to see Thames. She was screaming, complimenting Thames on her amazing work. And, you know, as a Nigerian, obviously, this makes me very proud to see one of our artists representing us, you know, in such, in such an amazing way. Rihanna has got to be one of the biggest acts on the planet over the past decade or so, I would say. So that's very amazing. Well done, Thames. You know, keep shining. If you want to see the video itself, please make sure you check out the link. We'll leave in the description below. The Google Conference and Travel Scholarships is currently receiving application. The purpose of this initiative is to um, pull out tech, um, brilliant tech minds from all corners of the world, especially focusing on underdeveloped or underrepresented um, groups such as, you know, third world countries, um, women, and such. So if you're interested in signing up for this on, you know, working with the minds over at Google, please check out the link we'll leave in the description below. All right, everyone, that has been it for our weekly roundup. Thank you once again for joining us. Remember, we couldn't go into all the details on today's show, so if you want the full story, make sure you check out our website. Follow us on our social media, our Facebook, um, Instagram, YouTube. We'd like to connect with you. Uh, make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it. And um, yeah, leave a comment in the description. If you have anything to say, share it with your friends. Anyway, once again, this has been Jason from Countryville. And remember, all we have is good news.